me, but. Oh, kill him. If you the type, if you the type that's going to take the CPR and give heart palpitations, and you the ambulance dude, be that. We learned that. I got a son. My oldest son is a transvestite. You're fucked on. Gay. Whatever you want to call him. You should let him know. I still had to learn to love the nigga. Because I realized what society did to the nigga, but I don't like what he is. And I'm going to tell you something right now. If he go around, my son that I'm talking about, he's going to look at that nigga like, what the fuck is that? Damn, what the fuck is that? It's not going to be nice. And I'm not going to make him. Hey, so what he just said about his own kids is that the kid that he's described as having a mental illness, he said that if his son that was a trans that, that is a transgender went around his son that got a mental illness, he wouldn't be nice to him and he wouldn't make him be nice to him. That's what the fuck he just said. So that's what he feel about his own kids. Nigga in the chat talking about he meant his son was a killer. It's like, nah, I don't see that. He talking about that little nigga got a problem, and he saying his other son want to respect him, right? Man, that, that man says one of his sons is a trans transgender, and he got another kid that he just that he said was quote unquote retarded, and he said that anything that come in front of him, he gonna call it out. So if his transgender son went around his the other, the other little, his his brother. That's what he sound would, like. Be mean to him. He would, he would talk shit about him. Right. That's what he said. And he said he wouldn't make him do no different. All right, Zane. What you think, Zane? What's your comment, Zane? Come on, Zane. Square, square. You ready, Zane? Y'all ain't never gotta ask me no shit like that. Square, square, bro. It ain't political. You know what I mean? I'm I got a little nephew that got autism, man, so, I mean, I ain't jacking no, no, no disrespect to nobody, nothing, 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 yeah, I mean, you know, about this come on, I was just, listen, I was just talking to my mother-in-law about this, like, she asked me a question about, like, if we had children, I told her, like, yo, I'm gonna support my son regardless of the fuck, he was like, yo, dad, I'm trying to be the best porn star in America, like, you know what I'm saying, what, what classes we gotta sign you up for to make you the best, bro, like, whatever you wanna do, bro, like, I'm, with, I'm, I'm, I'm supporting mine, bro, I don't, I don't know what's up. That's kind of weird. I didn't know he was playing the son like that. So my son was hard. That's weird. I think it's wrong with us. I'm going go right now. What's up, Pocky? I deal with a lot of children, bro. So I, I, got, a, I got a weird feeling when it comes to children. People say a certain type of, like, things. Like, I get the whole, like, you know, I get it sometimes, but sometimes I'm like, nah. I think that's too far. Like, I, don't, I don't really get what he's trying to say. Like, I, like, I'm even trying to look at it from like a maybe. On some, I don't, I'm not saying New York shit. I'm just saying like, man, I'm trying to see. Maybe he's saying it on some slang. New York. I don't get it. I don't get nothing what he's saying. You know, I can't defend him. I don't get what he's saying. Yeah, because it's not like yeah. how we used to say you retarded, like in a good way. You exactly, know how we used Ms. to be Dozier. funny, like yeah. nigga, you retarded, but it's not. That yeah, he got more, he way. got more spice on him. He got a little bit more right. spice on right. him. Yeah, yeah. and it's the Bobby. same slang as we used to use back then. That's, I like to know what he's gonna say to his kid when he get older. He's gonna say I did it. He's gonna say I did it. Nah, he gonna say I did it, and I ain't understand why I was saying that. I ain't, you know, I ain't understand that that time period. We didn't know what it was like, but I hope you forgive me. I know how this goes. No, he's not. He's gonna straight up just be like, "Well, it got y'all shoes and clothes, then I just did it to get some money." Like all the other celebrities do, but this shit is still fucked up. That's just gonna have them an excuse to do stupid ass shit. 
And we come out of the play, you know, Wag asked him, Wag asked him, you know, why you, you so gangster to the world, why you ain't gangster with that man? So we about to see what his answer was to that. In New York, the change. I don't respect New York. Let me ask you a question. Hold up, let me finish. Because anytime in New York, you got niggas, hey. rape, you got niggas on camera raping females on trains in front of stores and all types of shit Hold like on, that. Bro. This, uh, this, there's a sucker in our blood. Now we gotta ask this question because I, I, I'll be a bitch ass nigga if I think. Let's go. This question always arises. Let's go. We didn't get time. We didn't caught a couple bodies. Everybody want to know. Where was your enemy to rape because this man did something to you when you was a youngster, right? Right. So everybody want to know what happened to that energy when it came to you revenging your manhood with that man. I don't have it in me to kill that man because even though he violated me as, as a child, he protected and fed my mother's tears when my mother was going through certain shit. That ain't I'm got nothing to do. I'm not finished, though. Don't that take away from my violation, bro. Do not take away That's from not my the violation. Listen, let me You create a reason on why listen, you ain't gonna get out. Listen, hold up. You gotta stop. I'm not gonna hold, 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 hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. That nigga, wait. You created a reason on why you ain't gonna get out. That was the worst situation. I got raped. I got raped. I took it down because my man hit me up and he was like, We didn't get time. We didn't call a couple bodies. Everybody want to know where was your enemy to rape because this man did something to you when you was a youngster, right? Right. So everybody want to know what happened to that energy when it came to you revenging your manhood with that man. I don't have it in me. To kill that man because even though he violated me at his, as a child, he protected and fed my mother's tears when my mother was going through certain shit. That ain't I'm not, got nothing I'm to not do. finished, though. Don't that take away from my pain. bro. Do not take away That's from not my the pain. Violation. Listen, let me you create a reason on why you ain't gonna get out. Listen, hold up. You gotta stop. I'm not, that hold, up, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Hold up. Don't let me talk. Don't let me I still got nightmares. Don't take away from my horse. Oh, bro. Because if you, we don't play with child molestation. But you stay want to do something to a regular I, motherfucker who just saying, fuck you outside, kid. Hey, yo, you I, I, hold up, you. hold up. To all my niggas in the background that know me, if I ever wanted to do something to a nigga, did I ever hesitate? I'd have dropped. Fuck Oh, no, yes, you hesitated. No, actually, you definitely have hesitated. Listen, hold up. Because that didn't happen to that man, hold bro. Up, hold up. Now, gotta gotta hold up. Question. Let's get there. That man that violated me, yeah. when, I, when I decided that it was war, you don't know what the fuck happened in the streets, but what you do know is, you ain't never seen that man face to face with me. He was hiding in Brazil, hiding in London, hiding all over, all over on planes. So he ain't in New York right up. now? When he come to New York, he ain't standing in my face. My niggas ain't gonna let him stay. He's in Europe right now. My niggas ain't gonna let him stay. So when niggas sit up there talking about how you know, hold, 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 hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. Hold up. Hold up. All you gotta hold do is give a nigga reason to come back. Hold up, hold up. Certain things, uh -huh. hold up. So hold up. Certain things you can never say on the internet. Don't make me indict myself. The reality of it is, one thing you search and I know six nine search. search. Everybody know I've been locked up for bodies. We give you that. And if it's niggas is questioning if it, why I was in another body. Because because at that time. I was a nigga that was being molested since I was five or six. And that fucking faggot nigga saved me. That pedophile man, he saved me. So what you mean he saved me? He yeah. saved me because at the same time, the shit that I was going so to do. It went up to what days. age? It was days. It went up to what age? What you mean? Whatever the molestation. The molestation probably went up to I was like 13. See, I was putting in work already. I wasn't. I was, I was scared. Work. I was hungry. Hold up, I'm not finished. My mother, my mother, hold up, hold up, hold up. No, I get it. My mother, my mother. Someday you yeah, him to become who we became. My mother, that my mother it. some days, well, her gambling problem. And I don't like to speak on my mother like that because she's dead. Gotcha. So I don't want to put her out there and violate my mother. But my mother was coming up short. My mother had six kids. And that man was putting food in my refrigerator when I was nine and 10 and 11 years old. 
when my mother wasn't there to put that food in that fucking refrigerator. Yeah, but that nigga wasn't doing that. He used to do that. He putting food it in the refrigerator. Matter, because he's violating since, you, putting something in you, bro. Since Fuck that. You can't get that nigga no credit, bro. I was groomed. I was molested <laughs> by a bunch of people. I was groomed. And it's so, so it was more it than wasn't him. just him. I got violated by so many people. It was normal. Oh, and even shit. still, it's like everybody know a pedophile. In this room right now, if we really turned on a... There's somebody in this room. It's probably three niggas that's fucking children. Nah, we ain't doing that. Nah, nah, Hopefully not. we ain't doing that. Hopefully not, but we still got to say that. I ain't got no niggas in the room. That's the victim, bro. You talking about a victim doing victim stuff, bro? You wasting your time. The niggas not That's a what fucking victims do. Victim. My niggas a victim, bro. The bitch came on here talking. He got groomed, no but he definitely a victim, bro. Nah, nah. His first, his first, his, but his first man. instance is a victim, bro. First, he, no, you know no, no. You're right. He is yeah. a victim for what he went through before. But I'm talking about with the African body shit. All right, he got yeah, groomed yeah, to like right. that. He is a That's my bad. Yeah, yeah, you feel me? Like, his first time, he ain't, like, he ain't, it was like he's young and he went over to that man crib. And, you know what I'm saying? He was a victim, bro. Like, he got, he got, and they got groomed into that shit. Like, it was cool. Like, you got to think about it. Even what he's saying, yo, he used to feed me when my mom ain't had no money. That's some victim grooming shit, bro. That's making you think it's cool. Man, wait, say that nigga made up a reason not to get out. 
Yeah, yeah, he definitely. Was, <laughs> your whack is so stupid. You, you grow up and you start doing certain shit, and it's like you run into the hey, nigga yo, who big. violated you. Nah, you're big. Supposed to do yo, something to this yo, nigga. Yo, big. The nigga said you give it a reason not to get down, no. though. <laughs> hey, this nigga is so up. <laughs> You just make an excuse so you don't gotta get out. Like ruin shit for when you were a kid though, man. You can't be repeating hey, that shit when you were a grown ass man. You know what Hassan said though? He said, he said, yo, don't take away from my pain though. Hey, don't take it, don't don't silence my voice. Don't, don't take it from my voice. Don't silence my pain, bro. But the other nigga said that he had already had a relationship by the time he got to him and that it wasn't really grooming because he made the decision to nothing with me first like that. Yeah, that's it. what the other one that that Baba was in from said. Hey, me, me who was that dude with the J that's that's in y'all that's in Cloud Mouth A C who was that? Who me? Jo Jo Jo. Yeah, yeah. What's up? What do you mean that molestation moved the economy in the Bronx? What yeah, yeah, yeah. What you meant by that? Because I'm from what? the Bronx. Yo, you tripping yo, with that. Said the whole Bronx River was revolving around molesting or being molested. I was being sarcastic. Oh, okay, okay, okay. God damn. <laughs> yeah, like, you making it seem like that's what Bronx River economy was fucking running them on, yo. That's a yeah, you still step away from me, nah, nah. What the fuck does that mean? Like, oh, bro, like, that's what he said, bro. Now, I, bro, I'm, I'm, I'm being sarcastic, man. I he, you, you don't want to put that word Yeah. <laughs> what you do? Yeah, put uh, quotations out of this. What goes on the, in the hood? In the hood, caters to molestation. See what I mean? Just like in the hood. Uh, well, no, let no, me, please, let me finish. Let me cook. No, 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 no. That's not bro. Let me cook. The hood. That secret society. The hood. No, the hood. We knocking niggas down Yo, playing with kids. Bullshit. Bullshit. There's a lesson. Yeah, if a nigga Yo, play with a kid on my block, he get knocked down. Wow. I'm telling you some shit you ain't ever heard of. Who he is? No. Chris Rock. Chris, I think it was Chris Rock. He had a show where he was sitting up there laughing and joking about the uncle, the pedophile, or the stepdaddy. That's always there for Thanksgiving and Christmas dinners and everybody know about them. And you like, go get the kids out of the living room. There is a fucking pedophile in every family. And we let that nigga live. He never gets the worst of the worst. That motherfucker, the pedophile dies without nobody. The pedophile dies without right, nobody right, right, touching right, right, him. Right, right, he right. violates the innocence of every child. And nobody does right. nothing to him. And my whole thing is like this, right? You know what made me hate the streets? When I seen that niggas go fuck children. Talk about it. I seen niggas come outside, like in Bronx River, for example. When you see niggas come outside at 7 o'clock in the morning to get coffee, the bitch nigga ain't got a job. He waiting for your children to go to Monroe House High School. Then he out there at dinner at 3 o'clock because he waiting for them to get on the school bus to fuck your children. You know why I don't, oh, I, I, you know why, you know why I don't like the streets no more? Oh, why I don't respect the streets? Because I sat back and watched the nigga. Hey, Smitty, come home from the feds. Now, allegedly, what I'm going to say is, Allegedly, the Smitty said he didn't rap, but the world said that nigga ratted. He got caught with two keys on a fucking plate, right? And all of the niggas that called this nigga a rat. I'm about to run this shit back when Wax saved this nigga why he ain't get out, man. Why the fuck this nigga ain't get out? We done did time. We done caught a couple bodies. Everybody want to know where was your enemy to rape because this man did something to you when you was a youngster, right? Right. So everybody want to know what happened to that energy when it came to you revenging your manhood with that man. I don't have it in me to kill that man because even though he violated me as, as a child, he protected and fed my mother's kids when my mother was going through certain shit. That ain't I'm got not, nothing I'm to not do. finished, no. Don't that ain't the violation, bro. Do not take away That's from my That's not the pain. violation. Listen, let me You creating a reason on why you ain't gonna get out. Listen, hold up. You gotta stop I'm screaming not, that hold gangster up, hold shit. Up, hold up, hold up, hold up. ain't discriminating with the gangster, bro. Talk. Don't let me Don't let me talk. I still got nightmares. Don't take away from my horse. Oh, bro. Because if you, we don't play with child molestation. But you stay want to do something to a regular I, motherfucker who just saying, fuck you outside, kid. Hey, yo, you I, I, hold up, hold up, hold up. To all my niggas in the background that know me, 
If I ever wanted to do something to a nigga, did I ever hesitate? I'd have dropped. Fuck oh, yes, you hesitated. No, you definitely have hesitated. Listen, hold up. Does that hold up. That never happened to that man, hold up. bro. Hold up. Now, gotta let's, hold up. Question. Let's get there. That man that violated me. Yeah. When I when I decided that it was war. You don't know what the fuck happened in the streets, but what you do know is you ain't never seen that man face to face with me. He was hiding in Brazil, hiding in London, hiding all over, all over on planes. So he in New York right now? When he come to New York, he ain't standing in my face. My niggas ain't gonna let him stay. My niggas ain't gonna let him stay. So when niggas sit up there talking about how hold up, hold up, hold up, hold up. All you gotta do is give a nigga reason to come back. Hold up, hold up. Certain things, uh, hold up. So hold up. Certain things you can never say on the internet. Don't make me indict myself. The reality of it is, one thing you search and I know six nine search. Everybody know I've been locked up for bodies. We give you that. And That's if you niggas is questioning if it, why I wasn't up. another because, body. Because because at uh, I'll be having to stop this nigga, bro. Cause this nigga just said, don't make me indict myself. And then the very next sentence said, everybody knew I was locked up. <laughs> Her body. What bro, the, the fuck is the world coming to, man? What the <laughs> fuck is Come on, listening? man. Yo. This shit is you, fucking you crazy, fucking man. crazy. This nigga say, don't make me indict myself. Now, everybody knew I was locked up for bodies. <laughs> that's split personalities or something, man. I was, that's straight facts, man. This nigga is hilarious. This nigga, that bottle locked this nigga body up, nigga. <laughs> locked it up, nigga. Man, this nigga. It was like two different people. Yeah, this nigga is hilarious. Yeah, this nigga is hilarious. I was a nigga that was being my Everybody know I've been locked up for violence. We give you that. And that's why niggas is questioning why. What the other day? One thing you search and I know 6 9 search. Everybody know I've been locked up for violence. We give you that. And that's why niggas is questioning why I wasn't another body. Because at that time, I was a nigga that was being molested since I was five or six. And that fucking faggot nigga saved me. That pedophile fan, he saved me. So what you mean he saved me? He yeah. saved me because at the same time the shit that I was going so to do. It went up to what days. age? There was days. It went up to what age? What you mean? Whatever the molestation. The molestation probably went up to I was like 13. See, I was putting in work already. I wasn't. I was, I was scared. At work. I was hungry. When, hold up, I'm not finished. My mother. My mother hold up, hold up, hold up. No, I get it. My mother. My mother. So they used him to become who he became. My mother. That my mother some days, well, her gambling problem, and I don't like to speak on my mother like that because she's dead. Nah, she's I don't want to put her out there and violate my mother. But my mother was coming up short. My mother had six kids. And that man was putting food in my refrigerator when I was 9 and 10 and 11 years old when my mother wasn't there to put that food in that fucking refrigerator. Yeah, but that nigga wasn't doing that. He used to do that. He putting food in the refrigerator. It doesn't matter. Because violating you put something you bro. Since Fuck birth, that. You listen, can't get that nigga no credit, bro. I was groomed. I was molested by a bunch of people. I was groomed. And it's so, oh, so it was good. It, more it wasn't deal. just him. I got violated by so many people. It was normal. And even still, it's like everybody know a pedophile. In this room right now, if we really turned on a... There's somebody in this room. It's probably three niggas that's fucking children. Nah, we ain't doing that. Nah. Hopefully we not. We ain't doing that. Hopefully not, but we still got to say that. <laughs> I ain't got no niggas in the room. <laughs> that nigga would be dead, you know? Yo, I'm not gonna lie check this out. Know. Hey, I got to do something. You got to let me do something. Can I do something? I want to give my... I want to do something. I want to do something. This dude with this vibe. It's a sexual thing.